Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb has suggested that 3i Atlas, this strange interstellar visitor, is not just a comet, not just a frozen rock from another star system, but possibly some kind of alien technology. The universe is full of surprises, but some are far more dramatic than others. A recent highly sensitive internal communication now making waves suggests that NASA has achieved a monumental if unnerving breakthrough. Using the unparalleled clarity of the James Webb Space Telescope and the lightning-fast processing power of experimental quantum AI, scientists have reportedly pinpointed the exact moment a comet, known as 3i Atlas, will strike Mars. This isn't theoretical guesswork. This is a hard date. The sheer power of these tools to predict cosmic events with such precision is truly astonishing. But what happens when those predictions point to something truly monumental? a date with destiny. The sheer audacity of this prediction is what makes it so groundbreaking. You see, but not all things are what they seem. Comets are famously tricky targets. They are icy wanderers, often no bigger than a small mountain, moving at mind-boggling speeds, sometimes over 100,000 miles per hour. Pinpointing their exact trajectory with such accuracy that an impact date can be locked down has always been a monumental challenge. This is where the truly revolutionary part of the leak comes in. The convergence of the JWST's unparalleled observational power with the mind-bending capabilities of quantum AI. The James Webb Space Telescope is, to put it mildly, a marvel. Orbiting the second Lagrange point nearly one million miles from Earth, it's perfectly positioned to peer back to the dawn of the universe. Its primary mirror alone spans an incredible 21 feet across a honeycomb of 18 hexagonal gold-coated beryllium segments. This allows it to gather light with seven times the efficiency of the Hubble Space Telescope. When observing a faint, fast-moving object like Comet 3 I Atlas JWST's near-infrared spectrograph, NIR spec, and mid-infrared instrument, MIRI, are key. They don't just take a picture, they analyze the light, breaking it down to determine the comet's composition, temperature, and the velocity of the gases spewing from its nucleus. This level of detail is critical for predicting its path. The thing nobody tells you is that collecting this exquisite data is only half the battle. Interpreting it is the real Everest. The James Webb Space Telescope sends down terabytes of information, a digital deluge that would swamp conventional analysis. The leak suggests these specific datasets on 3i Atlas were funneled directly to Project Kronos. This quantum AI system, rumored to be housed in a shielded subterranean facility, was built for one purpose, to solve the unsolvable. While traditional supercomputers would take months to model the chaotic variables of a fragmenting comet wrestling with the infamous in-body problem, calculating the gravitational pull of multiple bodies on each other, Project Kronos operates on a different plane of existence. Instead of processing information sequentially, its qubits exist in a state of superposition, allowing it to explore billions of potential gravitational interactions, solar radiation pressure effects, and even the subtle outgassing from the comet itself that could nudge its path. The AI ran simulations that were not just faster, but fundamentally more comprehensive. It explored a web of possibilities simultaneously, collapsing them into the single most probable trajectory and, crucially, a definitive impact date for Mars. The precision suggested in the leaked reports is breathtaking. A specific month, day, and a narrow window of just a few hours. It represents a quantum leap in predictive astrophysics, a power many believed was still decades away. What many overlooked is that this technology wasn't just built to watch, it was built to foresee. The ghost of impacts past. The target, Mars, is a world scarred by a violent history. Its surface is a museum of celestial bombardments with craters ranging from tiny pockmarks to vast basins hundreds of miles wide. The leaked data doesn't just pinpoint a date, it suggests a potential impact zone in the northern lowlands, a region known as Arcadia Planitia. This area is relatively smooth and is believed to harbor significant subsurface water ice, making the potential impact a scientific gold mine. Comet 3i Atlas, while significant, is not a planet buster. The data indicates its largest fragment is about two miles across. Still, an impact of this scale on Mars would be a truly spectacular event, releasing energy equivalent to millions of megatons of TNT. 
an explosion far greater than all of Earth's nuclear weapons combined. Understanding the comet's wild journey is key to grasping the quantum AI's achievement. Comet 3I Atlas was first spotted in late 2019, a faint smudge on its long fall toward the sun from the distant Oort cloud. This Oort cloud is a vast theoretical sphere of icy planetesimals surrounding our solar system, extending out over a light year from the sun. These objects are frozen time capsules, holding pristine material from the solar system's birth some four and a half billion years ago. As 3i Atlas journeyed inward, the sun's warmth began to work its magic, causing its ice to sublimate, turning directly into gas and dust to form a glowing coma and a spectacular tail. However, in early 2020, a dramatic event unfolded. The comet began to break apart. Many people are crazy about how this happens. The intense solar radiation and gravitational forces created deep fractures, causing the nucleus to shatter into several large pieces and a cloud of smaller debris. This fragmentation event made its trajectory exponentially harder to predict. Each fragment now had its own unique path, subtly influenced by outgassing jets acting like tiny, unpredictable rocket thrusters. This is precisely where Project Kronos proved its worth by modeling the complex gravitational dance of not one, but four major fragments, each with its own chaotic behavior. It transformed a blurry picture of possibilities into a high-definition forecast. The thing nobody tells you about planetary defense is just how new and experimental it is. The DART mission in 2022, which successfully nudged the small asteroid Dimorphos, was a monumental proof of concept. But DART was like hitting a thrown baseball with a bat. Deflecting a fragmented comet like 3i Atlas would be like trying to stop a cloud of buckshot. The leaked documents allegedly contain simulations for potential mitigation scenarios, though they remain highly theoretical. They underscore a sobering reality. We can now predict certain impacts with incredible accuracy, but our ability to prevent them, especially on short notice or with complex targets, is still in its infancy. To put it mildly, the resilience of Mars's thin atmosphere will be put to the test. While it's only 1% as dense as Earth's, an object entering at over 100,000 miles per hour will still experience immense friction and pressure. The comet fragment will become a brilliant fireball, shedding mass as it streaks through the sky. But it's too big and too fast to be stopped. The impact will punch a hole through the atmosphere, sending a shockwave racing across the planet at supersonic speeds. The dust and vaporized ice thrown into the sky could create a temporary localized atmospheric shift, perhaps even generating clouds of water ice crystals and a brief, bizarre change in Martian weather patterns. What is the true power of the quantum brain that made this prediction possible? The data deluge deciphered. The secret behind this jaw-dropping prediction lies deep within the strange and wonderful world of quantum mechanics. While classic computers like the one you're using now rely on bits that are either a zero or a one, quantum computers use qubits. Thanks to a principle called superposition, a qubit can be both zero and one at the same time. What many overlooked is how this simple difference creates an exponential leap in power. A system with just 300 qubits can represent more possible states than there are atoms in the known universe. This allows them to process vast amounts of information in parallel, solving problems that would take a classical supercomputer longer than the age of the universe. Consider the sheer scale of the challenge. A comet's path is a textbook example of a chaotic system. It's a dance influenced by the gravity of the Sun, Jupiter, and every other planet, even tiny moons, along with the subtle push and pull of solar wind and the unpredictable jets of gas from its own melting ice. Each of these factors introduces tiny uncertainties that, over millions of miles, can compound into massive deviations. Traditional computational models have to sequentially test each variable, a brute force approach that is both slow and incomplete. The thing nobody tells you is that these models often rely on approximations, which inherently introduce error. The quantum AI, Project Kronos, is said to employ a technique called quantum simulation, it essentially creates a virtual model of the solar system at the quantum level. Instead of having to calculate each gravitational pull one by one, it can represent the entire complex system at once, allowing the interactions to play out naturally within the simulation. 
It's like the difference between reading a book about a storm versus creating a miniature storm in a bottle. The quantum AI doesn't just calculate the storm, it becomes the storm, exploring every possible outcome simultaneously. It can feel the entire landscape of probabilities at once, identifying the most likely path with breathtaking accuracy. This isn't just about faster processing, it's about a fundamentally different way of understanding reality. The cosmos, with its intricate gravitational ballet, is a prime example of a system where small changes in initial conditions lead to vastly different outcomes. The leaked data suggests that the quantum AI could effectively rewind the comet's path based on the high-precision JWST data, then run millions of futures forward in the blink of an eye, seeing where all the fragments would go. What many people are crazy about is that this technology effectively allows us to see into the future of celestial mechanics. The James Webb Space Telescope provides the eyes for this quantum brain. Its ability to see in infrared is crucial. It can detect the chemical composition of the gases spewing from the comet, allowing the AI to calculate the force of those jets. It can measure the surface temperature, predicting how the ice will sublimate. The quality of its data, combined with the AI's interpretive prowess, forms a partnership that truly embodies the next frontier of science. The most shocking fact is that this collaboration hints at a future where humanity has an unparalleled ability to predict and potentially even influence cosmic events. It is a tool of immense power, and like any such tool, it brings with it immense responsibility. How will this spectacular celestial event reshape the Red Planet forever? Observing a World Remade The prophesied impact of Comet 3i Atlas on Mars is more than just a fleeting light show. It is a geological event of a scale unseen in human history. An object two miles across, hitting the Martian surface at hypersonic speed, would excavate a crater estimated to be nearly 30 miles wide and up to two miles deep. To put that in perspective, this new feature on the Martian landscape would be large enough to comfortably fit a major city like Chicago. This isn't just a hole in the ground, it's a violent and instantaneous act of creation, a scar that will be visible from Earth-based telescopes for centuries to come. The immediate aftermath would be a spectacle of raw, untamed power. In the first fraction of a second, the comet's immense kinetic energy would be converted into a blinding flash of heat and light. A superheated plume of pulverized Martian rock and vaporized cometary ice would be blasted miles into the thin atmosphere, reaching altitudes where the air is practically a vacuum. As this material rains back down, it will form a vast ejecta blanket, a layer of fresh debris covering thousands of square miles. The most shocking fact is that this ejecta could contain materials from deep within the Martian crust, minerals and potentially frozen brines that haven't seen the light of day for billions of years. For future Martian explorers, this debris field would be an incredible scientific treasure trove. Seismic waves, a Mars quake of unimaginable magnitude, would ripple through the planet's interior. You see, these waves would travel through the core, mantle, and crust, and studying how they change would give scientists a CAT scan of the entire planet. It could definitively answer questions about whether Mars has a liquid core and provide a detailed map of its internal structure. This is the kind of data that could rewrite textbooks on planetary science. The long-term effects on Mars would be profound. The sheer volume of water ice delivered by the comet, estimated to be billions of gallons, would be instantly vaporized, creating a massive temporary steam atmosphere around the impact zone. As this water vapor cools, it would freeze into fine ice crystals, potentially creating expansive clouds and even snowfall, a bizarre weather event on the desolate planet. This sudden injection of water into the Martian system, even if temporary, could have lingering effects on the local climate and geology. The thing nobody tells you is that this process mimics the very way Earth may have gotten its oceans, through a relentless bombardment of icy comets in its youth. Many people are crazy about the idea of finding life on Mars. While the impact itself would sterilize a vast area, it could also be a catalyst for discovery. By excavating material from deep underground, the impact could expose ancient, preserved organic molecules or even signs of past microbial life that were protected from the harsh surface radiation. It's a long shot, but the possibility exists.
Witnessing such an impact gives humanity a ringside seat to the violent, creative forces that shape worlds. It's a chance to see planetary evolution in action, offering clues to mysteries that have puzzled astronomers for decades. We now possess the tools to predict the future of worlds, but who should be trusted with that power? Let us know what you think. Don't forget to like and subscribe.